company collect bulls today we're gonna do a buyer pass welcome back to the show ea sports it's in the game millennial drama today we're gonna to be looking at catwoman on comicconcepts.com comic concepts why because it's just plain out cheaper plus he's worked out better shipping rates that can save you a lot more money so why not and I'm gonna make a separate video for you guys on why I switched to a US retailer versus Hong Kong. It's a story. But nonetheless, we have Catwoman back from the dead here to troll us. Well, um, uh, who, I think Dirksius Maximus? I think, what, was it you? He said, this will hold us up until the next reissue of Catwoman. <laughs> Hot Toys is throwing in a base. And thinking that this will help us. A lot of people are saying, hey, easy. It might be a new suit, you know? I don't think so, guys. They keep releasing crap. Reissuing crap now. Um, Hot Toys, you're getting yourself shorted here. You're not really attending to what we want. You know, we wanted Ahsoka to be released. We wanted a 3.0 Joker. We wanted other things to reissue this figure. Oh my God. Quarter one, 2023. I don't know why we're waiting so long. They say a brand new head sculpt or paint apt, whatever. The base mold you some rusty cones. $269.99. That's here on Comic Concepts only. You get it cheaper than other websites. I got a boo-boo. Um... So they obviously they're doing you uh, same dealio here. Um, gonna have to say it's a bad pass. Hot Toys, why would I go in for a figure that you recently tormented me with? Um, flaking issues, problematic things, same old hair, which it ain't too bad. It ain't too bad. Um, same plathery suit. Paint apps improved, probably more red on the lipstick and the eyes. But, cool looking base nonetheless. I like that Hot Toys is stretching out with the cool looking bases. Nice thigh highs in that area. I like, what I'm trying to say is that these figures look good on prototype. Yes, it does. The photography, the lighting, they add it with other accessories making you want to buy them all. Yes. But Hot Toys, you have to convince me otherwise to think, why should I get this mistake again? Why should I go for this whole flaking materialistic suit again? I don't know. I wouldn't. I wouldn't go for it. I mean, just look at all the Catwomans. It's scary to buy a Catwoman. And on top of that, if you do find one, it's probably going to be flaked to the bake. You know? Nice flaky crust, rising. Sounds like a Fillsbury Doughboy biscuit out of one of those pop cans. Nice and flaky. Mmm. So, what do we get for the price rise besides the Dark Knight rise? Well, you get a new base. You don't get the Bat Pod, definitely. You don't get the Bat Pod. They're just teasing you. Very good posing, obviously, from this girl. Everything's nice and lined up well because of her. Oh, my God. Uh, don't touch that. But I just feel like this is a like a flick on the head. I don't know. I feel like it's stupid. I think with these releases, a Hot Toys Mexican wizard told me there's going to be a bane reissue now there's absolutely nothing bane was a beautiful figure i haven't had any flaking issues with that leather when i had it i'm just kidding it wasn't a mexican wizard it was just fobs figures from fabio you know figures the guy who has a warehouse of hot toys in his basement probably has three of these selena kyles if you want one contact him he probably got one for sale but I'm surprised they actually gave her a gun in the hand. Wow, DC's pretty strong about putting guns in their hands. So I guess they got a pass over here. It does come with a little tiny gun. 
and a half of a bat cowl, her little phonetics that goes on top of her head, and other than that, the butt looks flat. I'm kind of disappointed because she did have a really quality asset back there. And the base. I don't know. I, I, I can't. I can't repurpose... You know, the head sculpt is amazing. I, I like I like the paint apps. It's beautiful. I wish, you know, they would perfect the rest of the things. But with the deteriorating issues and constant go that Hot Toys is like, just keep releasing this garbage. I mean, for you guys, it's like, just don't buy it. I understand. But this ruins the entire industry. This ruins... You know, the collecting game. This ruins people to the point that we just stop collecting hot toys. For me, for example, I went on to statues. I haven't fully committed, but my statue pre-order list is growing and my hot toy pre-order list is diminishing. Now, Lord Vader, what will you do? this is something for you, then go ahead. I've warned you, and warned you, and warned you. Pleather is one of the worst materials you can put on these things. No matter how much care you can do sometimes, they still deteriorate. And at that premium price, why am I even trying to do that much? Adding products and, and doing more than I should be doing on something that cost... A good margin of my pocket I don't know but that's me that's me and that's what I think that's why you're watching the video to hear my thoughts and get my help this is my advice I do not go for figures that have fully apparitioned bodies of poltergeists no sorry pleather so I'm gonna have to pass although I like her suit and everything that looks good the materials being used on this, Batman. Uh, no, I'm sorry. This guy, much better. I like it. Hard polystone, hard as a rock. <clears throat> it doesn't fade away. That's why Comic Concepts also has... Let's type in here. Salina. Hopefully the singer doesn't come up because I don't want the singer. Comic Concepts has this. This. This looks so hot. So good. Extremely good. I, golly, dude. I, oh. So we also have this, which is also sold out. You can probably message him. Find out if you can get one. Look at that rear. I mean, they companies like this, yeah, you pay a pretty chunk. But look, her lips, though. But, I mean, it's it's still better quality. That'll last you. You see what I mean? It's there. It's there. It's right there. That's what I want. That's what I want to see. Accuracy. Asteris. Aster accuracy. So with that being said, I'm going to have to pass, guys. Obviously, this is my pass. If you, sir, are a Hot Toys Dark Knight super fan, then you wouldn't want to miss this. Looks great on the Bat Pod. Great side-by-side -side Batman or Bane. Wherever you want to put her, it's going to look dandy. So with that being said, you guys buy that because I don't want you to miss out because of my simple rant going on about her. But, on my end, I'm going to have to say now go. That is going to be the final verdict from Easy Company Collectibles because I don't tell lies. I don't lie to you. My wee wee. I don't lie to you guys. That's how you know. I don't lie. See you guys later. Goodbye.